Across the state today, Rhode Islanders hit the streets to pick up garbage for this weekend's Earth Day. And at Roger Williams Park, hundreds of volunteers were hard at work picking up pounds and pounds of trash. Eyewitness News reporter Catherine Sotnik met up with those volunteers, and she has more on the cleanup from the Providence Mobile Newsroom. This is the stuff I don't like. Volunteers from across Rhode Island do some back-breaking work Saturday to clean the ponds around Roger Williams Park. We've got some ketchup bags, oh, okay. burnt styrofoam. Before all the fol foliage is uh, clouding your view, we're able to pull out bottles and trash uh, with these special uh, rakes that we made. And this year, a record number of volunteers came out for Earth Day weekend. Roger Williams Park is like the biggest park in Providence, and this is the biggest place that we can make our impact with the volunteers that we can leverage. And the work is not easy. Well, I'm a lobbyer. I'm here to clean up all the brush so the paths are clean for the people to come through and pick up the heavy stuff. Uh, it's going well. You know, there's a lot of trash here, so we're trying to get it cleaned up for everybody to enjoy it. The Earth Day event at Roger Williams is put on by Serve Rhode Island, which administers the AmeriCorps program. It is their fifth annual park cleanup. Someday they hope they can swim here, but we've got a ways to go on that. And in past years, we're told more than 8,000 pounds of trash was picked out of that Roger Williams Park Pond area. I'm Katherine Sotnik, Eyewitness News.